What's going on guys? Ryan here. Uh, this is my first real life video on this channel. I'm just basically getting my boots on. I'm about to go outside and uh, show you guys, I guess, around my house, property, place, and uh, take a ride on this thing I, I have called a Gator. It's kind of like a lowered, slowed down version of like a go-kart or like a, uh, <laughs> like a, uh, hmm, well that's about all I can really think of. Or like a golf cart, I guess. But that's my brother's dirt bike right here. That's his other one because he's a bastard. It's like my garage all up in here. All this kind of cool stuff. And then here's my dirt bike. Over here. It's a CRF 250R. I like it, but not when it's broken like it is right now. So, yeah. Hopefully, oh yeah, I got this little thing under here too, a little pocket bike, it's pretty sick, it goes like 70 miles an hour and you're only like a couple inches off the ground, it's kind of dangerous, but, you know, and look, it snowed, oh my god, like a lot too, like, here's my boot, it goes all the way up to there if you can't tell, yeah, it went up pretty high, um, we got a little back over there. We used that to clear out my driveway because I hate shoveling, but I had to anyway. And my dad barely like used that freaking backhoe, which I didn't see why, because it's so much easier. Alright, actually, let me get off and show you what this thing is. Um, it's basically a beast. It's got six tires, six-wheel drive. Yeah, last night we had, <laughs> well, you can see it didn't work out very well. We had a, a rope attached here, and this is part of the sled we were pulling, but uh, I whipped them so hard that it, they actually flew, like, completely sideways in the air, and it just ripped the sled in half, and uh, there's the sled in half. It just tore. It's pretty fun, though. Probably going to do it again tonight. Go get another sled. Uh, all right. Bring this up there so it doesn't get tangled up. Hopefully this thing's gonna start. It's been really, really cold here. I'm gonna ghetto rig this with a screwdriver. I don't think you guys are gonna be able to hear me when this is on. You might be able to, but uh, you know, if not, I'll just like commentate over this anyway. So let's do it, man. Where's the choke at? There it is. Let's try this. Hold on, I'm gonna put the camera down, guys. Okay. Woohoo! Oh, that's not that loud. Alright, we're gonna go. Show the face toward. And we're back. I don't know how long this is gonna go because I put a barely any. Oh, God, that was bad. I barely put any gas in. So, because we barely have any gas. This gas is expensive. Let's see if we can make it around the trail once before it actually breaks and dies and we're all on that. Uh, like, you could literally take a car back here and it'd probably get stuck with this thing. Just fucking everything. It doesn't matter. Oh god. Bumps. Ah. <laughs> That. Wow, my camera is just freaking out right now. Chill. I just zoomed in. Yeah, I hit the zoom in button. I was so excited. There we go. Oh, Lord. Oh. oh gosh. So, uh, I'll probably have a gameplay up later tonight, because I haven't done one of those in a little while. Oh man, I almost hit the street. Not really. Yeah, but, um, and I'm also making, like, not really, like, an episode. I don't want to be a copy off Optic Predator, but it is kind of an episode, because I didn't know what else to call them. And, uh, it's just going to be, like, little mini edits of clips that I get, and stuff like that. Because I have a bunch of editing software that I don't really use anymore, so I'm trying to get back into editing. And uh, that's about it. 
Maybe I should put some cool music over the oak. <laughs> that was a bush, never mind. You guys are probably gonna want to hear me cry like a girl if I get like her. Oh lord. Oh, this is actually pretty nice. Maybe I should make like a little edit out of this. Maybe not, I don't know. Nice scenery out here. That's why when I get older, I want to live someplace like this because not to be really bothered with your neighbors as much. You kind of just keep to yourself. But I do have friends around, but not that close. In case I want to chill with somebody. Hopefully you guys can hear what I'm actually saying right now. Oh God, <laughs> that was a hill. Hmm, maybe I should show you guys my dirt bike jump. Yeah, I'll come back around and do it. Maybe like harder too. Hopefully I'm holding this camera straight too. I don't know what's good with that. I'm gonna go drift in the, in the street. Uh, oh. Drifting with one hand, is that a good idea? I know everyone's probably saying yes right now, but I don't know about it. There's my car. Oh, I see it. Oh yeah, and I just put 12 octane, which is like racing fuel in this thing, so maybe it'll go a little faster. Oh shit. Oh, that's a trash can. Oh my god. All right, this is definitely a bad idea. F that. My hands are freezing because I can't hold the camera with gloves on. I'm freezing for you guys. I hope you guys like this video. It's getting kind of long. This is just some like random video I decided I would upload for you guys because I haven't really put anything up yet. Um, yeah, so, you know, I know I only have like 14 subs right now, but leave a comment. Much appreciated. I love you guys. Um, that's a, oh God, I just, I just killed the backstop. I'm an idiot. Okay, back up. When I used to play baseball back in the day, before I broke my wrist. Oh, all right. Oh, that's a backstop again. Uh, oh, that's a golf cart. Oh shit. Oh well, I think that's all right. Actually, you know what? This isn't a Call of Duty video. I don't think you guys would mind if it goes a little weird. What else can we do? <sighs> Definitely not the golf cart. Mm. Wait, did I leave anything in there? Hmm. Nope. Okay. Ooh, look at that reflection. Hey, you. It's good. Alright. Mm. my BMX bike right over there. Mm, used to BMX a lot. I almost said quite a bit, but I don't want to say that. Um, yeah, that's a siding cutter. It's an Odyssey thing. I don't know. We got a lot of toys in our house. Pretty lucky to grow up with all this crap. And, uh,. Yeah, you know, a lot of people are thinking, like, oh, this kid's a spoiled brat, but nah, I just got lucky that my dad did pretty well, but, you know, I'm really appreciative of it all, so, if that makes you guys feel a little bit better about it, um, and plus, you guys can come hang out with me, serious, alright, alright, well, hope you guys like, peace.